Hello everyone and welcome. This is my first tutorial with voice. Today I would like to talk about a game, a racing game. It's called Juiced. This game. If you guys want to play it on Windows 7, you can't because it's not compatible. So today I'm going to show you how to make it work. Also, there is another problem with the game. If you're trying to configure controls for the keyboard or anything else, you can. And I'm going to teach you how to do that also. So, uh, yeah, before I forget, I'm going to teach you how to disable the auto save future so let's start open your game folder and try to run the game and you get this now this is how you fix it right click on the games icon properties select compatibility and click check this run this program in compatibility mode for Windows XP and select service pack 3 or 2 I will select 3 and uh, this one run this program as an administrator and just click OK now we can run the game in Windows 7 you will be able to get inside the game and then when you try to configure controls you will get this error there is a problem with your direct direct input registry settings now I will show you how to fix this one you have to download two files which I will upload and uh, you will see the link in the description of the video so my files are here somewhere yeah here you need to download this in order to make the game controls to fix the game controls and uh, after you download these files you will need to extract them you just right click on them if you have installed WinZip or WinRAR or something similar and take them, copy both of them and go to your game folder and just paste them here I have already done that and then you need to run this fix direct input you're gonna see this message just press any key and you're done you can fix your keyboard change the layout and I said I'm going to teach you how to disable autosave future also yeah you need to go to my computer see users your name obviously application data roaming and here you look for THQ this is the company that made the game and here is your save game folder so you play a while or let's just say you do the first race and then you save your game and get out you exit the game you come here 
and then you just right click on this folder and you're going to add it to archive or you can simply just do like I did add to just archive and then you have this what you did here was just like saving your game but not in game but in windows so now you can go back to the game and do another race and if you win you come back and repeat the step that I that I just so showed you and if you lose you have to extract this file so you go back to the previous state that way you will not lose any money or any race any cars and all that so this is it now you can play the game on Windows 7 configure your keyboard and also disable the autosave feature hope you enjoyed this tutorial I'm sorry about my English it's not my native language but I'm trying my best so if you have any questions just leave your comments and I will respond as soon as I can have a nice day bye